guys, welcome to another review. Here's my review of the movie Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. Yup, this is the sequel to Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse, which was my favourite animated movie of 2018. Yeah, that's when it came out and I thought it was a great movie. I thought it was a great collaboration between Sony Pictures Animation and Marvel as well as a great introduction to Miles Morales. So, of course I was hyped for this sequel. It's one of my, I put it as one of my most anticipated movies of this year. So, what did I think of it? I thought it was an amazing sequel. It lived up to the hype. And it was awesome to see how they could expand upon, like, the Spider-Verse sort of, with all these amazing cameos and different iterations of Spider-Man and all that. Um, I loved Marvel's relationship with Gwen, in the, with Gwen Stacy in this film. It was still great. I thought the soundtrack was awesome. Um, the villain was another good, was another great supervillain. And the animation is still really top-notch with how it combines comic animation with hand-drawn comic book style animation. Overall, I love this movie and this and the Super Mario Brothers movie are so far the best animated movies of 2023 for me at least. Hopefully others that are upcoming will be just as great so let's hope this year for animated movies continues to be an improvement from last year's. As for my rating, I'm gonna give Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse a solid 10 out of 10. So those are my quick thoughts on Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, so tell me in the comments, are you going to go see this movie? If you have, what did you think of it? Tell me down in the comments, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.